often um, a, you know, a different type of saw. On the end of the workbench, there were the hooks that they hung the leather strops on and the dust of where the beetles had finished eating out the leather of the leather strops. Yeah. And next to that were strips of something that looked a bit like corn plaster. And they sent it off to the botanists at Kew to identify. They found it had cellular structure, but not plant cellular structure, had fungal cellular structure. Sent it up to the mycology department at Kew who said, oh, all those funny Victorian old wives' tales are true. Oh, really? <laughs> so they then had a field trip yeah. into whatever it was, Bart's Hospital, yeah. to have a look and started collecting the spores <laughs> to prove it. And there were still spores that were still viable a century later. Yeah. And this all happened because they wanted to pull a false wall down and use the space that was behind it in, in some, at some period in the, in so the last century. Wall. It was behind a false wall. They just sort of, oh, yeah, we don't use this old wow. chest of drawers and all this equipment. And I just put it off. Just the Should we strip it out? No, I just put yeah. the false wall up. Yeah. And they found, all, they, found all the, they found all the brass instruments as well. They found all the saws and... Uh, yeah. I talked to people. Some people once who got a cottage on the penines they bought and they opened up a, a, a hidden corner and there's a dead parrot in the cage wall up in the wall. That's <laughs> where <laughs> 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 It wasn't a person. <laughs> <laughs> well, they didn't tell me about that bit. <laughs> but, but you wonder how they anybody ever thought, you know, oh, I'll yeah. try sharpening my knives on that. Yeah. Well, how do you find these things? That's right, yeah. Something. Yeah, but it's, but but it's really that white. surface. It's that surface. Yeah. Right, you yeah. think it was also used as tinder? And yes, oh yes, yeah. Oh, yeah. As well. Really? Yeah. What's his name? Ertzi. Ertzi, the ancient man that was found in... Uh, his mummified remains were found in the Alpine Pass between Austria and Switzerland, Switzerland, Italy, about 20 years ago. Uh, he was found with a, a leather pouch around his neck, and in there he had a striking stone and a flint, and three fungi, and a bit of leather that was used as string or twine. The three fungi, two were tinder <coughs> fungi for lighting a fire with, and the third was a puffball. And the puffballs were used as styptics because the spores on a puffball are spiny, like a sea urchin. Stop bleeding. Yeah. And the gaps between the spines are exactly the same size as the red blood cell. So if you puff the spore dust onto a cut, then the blood will naturally clot around the spores yeah. and that will promote, well not promote healing, but it will stop vast bleeding. So he was carrying his first aid kit. Oh, <laughs> This is a really beautiful um, bluebell with a